Austin's becoming one of the most futuristic cities in the entire country. Now that Tesla's headquarters is located right here in Austin, get ready for Boomtown. What up? Roshetsky Photography. Today we have a great Giga Texas drone video in store for you today with special guest Gally from Hyperchange. So strap in with your boots, get your popcorn ready. Let's check in with Giga Texas and see what the progress is because we all know Tesla is one of the fastest moving companies that we have currently on earth. Moving and accelerating the transition to sustainable energy has never been faster. Elon Musk has done this all in a blink of an eye and the future couldn't be brighter. So let's check it out here at Giga Texas. Let's get the drone out and see what we have in store today because we have a special delivery showing up at the battery section here at Giga Texas. We've realized that the, the true problem, the true difficulty, and where the greatest potential is, is building the machine that makes the machine. In other words, building the factory. And really thinking of the factory like a product, N not, not sort of a hodgepodge of, 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 of things that, that are bought, you know, where the machines are kind of bought from a catalog. But actually, just like we do with the car, you know, we don't try to create a car by ordering a bunch of things off a catalog. We design the car the way it should be, and then we make it. What up, HyperChange? Tesla's disruption of the pickup and electric vehicle space is coming faster than ever. This was an event that broke the internet just a year and a half ago. And if you'll remember, it was met with extreme skepticism in the media, a massively botched launch. They broke the window. Everybody thinks the Cybertruck's ugly. It's a disaster. That was the mainstream status quo. I bought Tesla stock hand over fist after that. I was like, what are you talking about? They have got billions and billions of pre-orders. This is potentially one of the most successful product launches of all time. Tesla has pioneered this Kickstarter-esque model where they launch pre-orders for a, a vehicle and start generating massive demand ahead of production. Um, this is a beautiful strategy to get demand going, to, to sort of test the markets. And the Cybertruck, we've got new news that a crowdsourced reservation tracker that has sort of been the de facto Cybertruck tracker um, who, you know, people that put their order in, put in the reservation number, they can calculate how many orders in the backlog has. These have proven to be pretty consistent um, and accurate with Elon Musk's tweets. And now this number has gone well over a million and I am one of those numbers one of those Cybertruck pre-orders and along with millions of other people across America that are willing to change our future for a better are willing to invest in a future that we want to see because we're sick and tired of seeing the same old same old we have Elon Musk coming along changing the truck market that has yet been changed for around a hundred years now. We have the same exact trucks riding around on a unibody, and we finally have a stainless steel exoskeleton electric pickup truck finally coming to the market. And here, right here in front of us here in Austin, Texas, we have one of the largest factories that will be producing these trucks right here before our eyes. It is just unbelievable that it is almost finished from dirt to steel beams to a completed factory we're seeing the future unfold before our eyes and it is absolutely gorgeous Either we or with, with working with suppliers make all of those individual components. And there's almost nothing in a Model S that's in any other car. And I think the same approach is, is the right approach to take when building the machine maker, uh, the, the, the factory, the machine that pulls the machine. Uh, 
I actually think that the potential for improvement in the machine that makes the machine is a factor of 10 greater than the potential on the car side. I think maybe more than a factor of 10. And if you don't already follow Galley on YouTube, check him out at HyperChange. HyperChange is the era of perpetually accelerating disruption. And Elon Musk has definitely turned what I call the fossil fuel technological suppression right on its head. Now we have an accelerated boost that is going to be changing the human civilization faster than in history. through the factory. It's like speed and density. The faster you go, like if a factory that's moving at say twice the speed of another factory is equivalent to two factories, basically. And the, the company that will be successful is the co company that with one factory can accomplish what other companies take two or three or four factories to do. So this is what we're trying to do here is, is say, okay, how do we with one factory achieve what maybe five or even 10 factories would normally be required to achieve? This entire thing has really become bigger than just saving the planet from the fossil fuel driven cars that we drive and saving ourselves from all the money that we waste. It's really become a lot bigger. We're talking AI, we're talking RoboTaxi, we're talking Tesla bot, we're talking SpaceX Starship to the moon and to Mars. We're talking Starlink, we're talking interplanetary communications. Things have changed. I know one thing's for sure. I'm no stock analyst. Don't take any of my advice. Don't sue me, bro. There's one company that I'm investing in and one company only, and I'm keeping a special eye on that one company. And let me let me tell you something, it's not Ford.
And thanks again for watching. I'd like to give a special shout out to all of my new Patreons, especially Matt Laughlin, who just recently signed up for Patreon with Roshetsky Photography. And if you think this video has brought you value, you can sign up for Patreon as well. There's a link in the description. But everyone else out there, don't forget the best form of support is simply being here and watching my videos. But to sign up to get extra perks, bonuses, and early access to all of my videos. And we will also get your name in these videos as well. So thanks again, Matt. Thanks again, Adam Block, Bob Callahan, Butch McIntosh, David and Sarah Delgado, Rick Thor, Tyler Schaefer, David Wheeler, Leela Elliott, Clayton Handelman, San Electric, and Evie Bike Dude. Thank you guys so much again for supporting me on Patreon. I really couldn't have done it without you. I can't wait for my Cybertruck.